Well, hello there. Welcome to the Poyer Pocket, where I share about personal growth, marriage, recovery, and my absolute favorite, The Office. This show has meant so much to me, and I'm so excited to show you what our experience was walking through this because it basically changed my life. So let's get right into it. It was the most beautiful drive into Chicago with wonderful snow coming down and it was fluffy and it was not dangerous yet or anything. So we listened to the Office Ladies podcast and we listened to the hilarious episode called Gay Witch Hunt. I am just way too excited to be here. And so luckily I took lots of videos to show you guys and my husband helped as well. And he just tried to make this experience all about me, but I think he had a pretty great time too. They decked out every wall that they could for this experience all the way up into, until we get all signed in and get our picture taken and we got a really cool little badge too. See those nunchucks in there? They had a few different items that you can kind of pause and look through and try to see what they left in there because Dwight's car is just too cool. Ridiculous question. Ridiculous question. The question. What kind of bear is best? It's a ridiculous question. False. Black bear. False. So all of that was really fun and just to like reminisce, reminisce and go through old stuff of the office. They even had the turtle that Kevin squashed and the pyramid. It was so cool, but I had no idea what it would feel like for this next part. We had to pause here because it was starting to hit me how surreal this experience was. And this is where it doesn't matter if I show you everything that I, that we got to experience on this. You don't know what it's like until you go through it yourself. And you are literally like the shape that you are walking through the door frame the way they did into this space that they did and they acted in. And just this thing you see on TV becomes real it was my it was a dream that i didn't even know i could have you got to actually sit in their desk and everything was laid out how it would be and just feel what it was like to be there. This is the real true fans tippity top of the iceberg of experiences. Absolutely 100% recommend. Oh, wow. Should have a cat on the bottom. 
I was hoping to find Angela's cat in there or something similar. But hold on, I actually do in the next clip. Guys, we even got to race each other. I mean, it's pretend just for the picture, but <laughs> we got to pretend to win Floggerton, which is just crazy. And you can see up in that corner, the birds even going across for the, you know, Olympic like winning. I just was in the show. This is ridiculous. You have to go to this. The fun just kept going and going and going. It it was so great. These are some of my favorite photos. The sumo wrestler, the spilling the chili. I thought this was so creative and it made my day. <laughs> You could tell that it was starting to wrap up and there were just a few more stops, but really all the way there was something new and some new quote to find on a wall somewhere. We didn't even capture everything. There were so many other points that are just, you have to see them to really get the fun out of it. Happy tears here at the end. It was so fun getting to share this with you, and I hope you get to do this at some point. If you would like to see more of my videos, please subscribe and like this video. And just here at the end, I wanted to show you just a little bit of the merchandise that you could buy. And then I had to do just one last fun picture before I headed out and just got to reflect the rest of the the rest of my life, but the rest of this day on how absolutely incredible this experience was. Thanks, guys. <laughs> I feel like they say different ones each time. There's so many. Really? I want to like put it on speaker.